in this question, Erin uh, is receiving stickers. She gets some on Monday and she gets some on Tuesday. And we have to determine how many more stickers she needs to get to a total of 80 stickers. Okay, let's break it down. Let's start with the first sentence. Well, if Erin gets 27 stickers on Monday and 36 stickers on Tuesday, so we'll put it here, and Monday, Erin gets 27 stickers. On Tuesday, she gets 36. And if we add these two together, we'll know how many stickers she has so far. Okay, so 7 plus 6 will give us 13. So that's 3, carry the 1. Two plus 1 is 3, plus 3 is 6. So after Tuesday, she's going to have 63 stickers. And we have to determine, well, how many more will she need to get to 80? Well, one way to do it would be to take the total 80, and if we subtract the 63 she already has, we'll find out how many more she needs. So let's do this subtraction. 3 from 0 we can't do, so we've got to borrow from the 8. So this becomes a 7, and this becomes 10. So 10 minus 3 is 7, and 7 minus 6 is 1. Another way to do it would be to draw a number line. And at the bottom would be the 63 that she already has, and she wants to get up to 80 at the top. And we can add in the units, so 63, 64, 65, 66, etc. So here's our number line, and we know that Aaron already has 63 stickers. We'll put a dot at 63 at the bottom. And then we'll count how many steps it takes us to get up to 80. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 steps to get up to 80. So that number matches the number when we did the subtraction. So therefore, we're pretty confident that she's going to need 17 more stickers to get up to 80.